my latest purchase from uh, my Wish supply line in China. And uh, it's a proof, proof of concept. Things are getting through. This was about 20 bucks. Notice so I'm not using my, uh, uh, not using my tetanus blade. This, uh, I think, was about 20 bucks from Wish. And in spite of everything, I had like four shipments coming. Ooh, she does not come with a box. Yeah. And the stand is in here. Now, mind you, I had ordered one of these at quarter scale off eBay last year, and the seller never shipped. And then they got their account canceled. So I got stiffed $20.69. And I don't know how to get the charge reversed from eBay. Okay. I don't see anything else in all this tension sheet. get? I got uh, it's a seventh, one sixth or seven scale Sakurajima Mai Senpai with an M. I was hoping to get a quarter scale version of her. Not fuzzy. Apparently so I haven't, didn't get one of her yet, and uh, she's still showing up on Wish. Hopefully I can get a quarter scale version of her. So things are still coming through Wish. Let me uh, figure out how to get these on here. And there we go. Always. So, I guess the reason why they're cheap is that uh, there is no box for her. Otherwise, I think this is probably one of those arcade prize, uh, prize figures. Alright. Well, it was 20 bucks or so. I mean, shipping was free. Now, a recent, another recent purchase of a figure. Show her over here. This came from California. That's Shirai Kuro Kuroko. This is from uh, Index. Certain Magical Index 2. And I got her. She's not the same size as my uh, Misaka. This is from Railgun. She actually does say on there. Misaka was a, a, a used purchase, and I, got, I think I got her for like 10 bucks. This is Shai Kuroko. I had to pay for shipping from California. And the reason why I got her finally is that there is um, an anime, a story in the anime and recently before the break, and a recently published uh, thing in English. Shirai Kuro Kuroko is tough as nails. My god. She goes in and she fights for every every bit of her effort. So I was like, you have to recognize that. Now, here's the funny thing. is uh, Teen Butayaro isn't dreaming of Bunny Girl Senpai because they never translate the title right. I've not watched it. I think I may have watched a little bit of the first episode and then this might have been happening during my forestry free location because of a selfish entitled piece of crap uh, family member who really didn't need 
to do it to do what they did. Anyway, I'm finally I, I got one, but she won't be the only one. I'm trying to get a quarter scale version of uh, Sakura Jimamai. Team Butoyaro. I hate I hate what they try to they try to translate the p title of that one. Anyway, that was a quick unboxing. I had unboxed her earlier. That's the reason why she's not in a box. And uh, if I have the time left, working with a device with only a gig of RAM, a <laughs> gig of storage on the storage card, free. And if I can get it done, uh, well, she's out of the package. You can see her better. Now, other versions of her were running about 50 bucks. This was 20 bucks with shipping, which I felt was alright. She is tough as nails. This is somebody... I, I was amazed by, by what they have her go through. Now, notice, she does not have fishnets on. Bunny girls do not use fishnets. Stop using... Cosplayers, stop using fishnets. Get black, sheer to waist, tights or something. Surely there is something you can get that's very comfortable. And that's my finer point. Bunny girls. Costume is supposed to look tight. Yeah. Anyway, that's this. This is unboxing. I unboxed her even if she was already out of the box, but I'm not sure what this injury was. I know she appears in Magical Index, but I've never watched any of a certain Magical Index. Railgun is my thing. Alright, thank you for watching, and if you want, you can kiss my ass and like and subscribe and uh, or whatever, and if you didn't like it, too bad, <laughs> just don't be a jerk. Alright, thank you.